I wonder if something happened. I feel like somebody's watching us. Wasn't expecting a thank you for that. Maybe socializing with people is helping to jog his memory bit by bit. You d
Are you stuck on that too? No, really. I kind of see where they're coming from. Are you okay with anything as long as it's round and flies? Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. now you two or else you'll catch a cold Onward and upward. Is that the Zugul we're looking for? Retreat if you know what's good dirt. for you. I never miss. Here I come. Dan. Ready to go. Do it. Power of water. Be careful, Evil everyone. Side. This Ready one isn't normal. normal. I'm just yeah. getting to it. <sighs> Pesky airborne yeah. scoundrel who put me like and kept behind us. Truly. I'll be right as brain in no time. Do it! Blow hey. them, them away! <laughs> Am I on a roll or what? Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood. Keep moving. That looks like the Zoogle we were told about.
Looks like we made it here in one piece. Sign, we should be making a hoodle sign. Ah, he's feeling threatened by arrival. Huh? I think someone's calling out for us. They could have something they need from us. Hmm. Oh? What? Yes! Yes! Hmm? <sighs> nice! Got it. Just a minute.
great. Marble curry. <laughs> now I can eat this every day. Jeez, Shion, you're hooked on that stuff. Looks like we made it here in one piece.
You can never be too prepared. But did we have to spend so much? Blazing sword okay? A little water's not going to hurt it. <laughs> What's that huge Zuko over there? Stay far away from that thing, Rinwell. To regret Time hey, when did I get so popular? Okay. They hit Mike with black and gray. Flame 
are bearing fruit. Looks like we made it here in one piece. Having to 
the former mother her son died isn't an easy thing to do. But if not us, then who? That's why we have to find her. Sorry. Yes. Uh. Hmm. All right. can she think of putting her son to rest as work? Because that's the way people were made to think about every aspect of their lives. I know she doesn't mean anything bad by it. I know that, but... It looks like she went out of town to take care of her son's body. That's a little concerning. There are Zoogles roaming around out there. We should follow after her. I wonder what we'll find out there this time. Most likely Zoogles, I would reckon. I mean, other than them. We should be able to cook here. Yes. What?
I'm afraid not. I'm sorry. Rinwell. That little speech you gave back there was pretty impressive, Alfin. If you call letting your emotions get the better of you impressive, sure. It made them stop fighting with each other, right? However you managed it, you knocked some sense into Rinwell and Dohalim, and that mother. Yeah. I can see my decision to travel with you was well made. Something's eating at you again, huh? I don't know if I would say that. I just... I mean... Actually, I guess I do have one or two things on my mind. My people, we lived in hiding. So we never really experienced the full extent of Renan oppression. Not directly, anyway. After Almadria killed my mother and father, though, I... I guess that's when I started hating them so much. The Renans, I mean. But then I think of all those people who were born into slavery. The ones who never even got angry in the first place because it was all they ever knew. I hear you. Every city we've been to, it's the resistance that gets labeled the troublemakers for having the guts to do the right thing. When it comes down to it, sometimes I wonder which of us really has the better way. You can't let your anger eat away at you, Rinwell. But then again, losing your parents that way. Hell, who could really blame you for it if you did? <laughs> I guess what I'm trying to say is... Uh, sorry. Hell, it's hard putting this stuff into words. No, I get it. You're saying that grief and anger are different than hatred. I never thought of it like that. But hearing you say it, it makes sense. Thanks, Law. Uh, you're welcome? Hmm. I think I get the gist of this now. Came out great. Everyone's gonna be real surprised. After mastering countless recipes and gathering enough ingredients to last a lifetime, I finally cooked my greatest, grandest masterpiece Mabo Curry! This is a specially made, one of a kind batch. It contains only the best combination of spices, chosen after a lot of trial and error. Your. Spices. Uh, I think I'll have some later after everyone else. I'm not that hungry right now. You sure? It does smell pretty tasty now that you mention it. The heat from the spices is intense, but not persistent, so it's easy to go back for seconds. You're making a good case for your curry, Alfin. What the hell? Serve me up! Um, mmm. Oh wow, this is actually good. 
Mmm. To be honest, I'm a little scared how my stomach will handle all these spices later. But they really do bring out the flavor. Indeed. The spiciness has been so finely tuned. Why, I dare say you've made true art, Alfin. Right? I knew you guys would like it. Like it? I love it! This is delicious, man! Law, really? Don't talk with your mouth full. There's plenty for everyone, so eat as much as you like. Shion, could we talk a moment? Hey, do you have time to talk? There's something I need to ask you. Of course. What's up? It's about the doll I used to have as a little girl. I gave it some more thought, and I still don't remember actually receiving it from anyone. You were so little. I don't think it's that surprising you've forgotten, is it? Yeah, but here's the thing. That doll was so old, I'm starting to think I just always had it with me from the start. I know that it's extremely unlikely, but after last time we talked, it got me thinking. Maybe... Maybe you brought the doll that child made with you to Lenegas. I couldn't be. Are you saying you didn't? Ugh. Look, logically speaking, I know it's a lot more likely that you didn't bring it with you than you did. But you can't say for sure you didn't, right? Crazier things have happened. I always thought I'd be alone, only to end up meeting you and Law and Rinwell and Kisara and Dohalim. Sometimes things happen in life that we never thought possible. You make a good point. I left everyone and everything I knew behind 300 years ago. But now, I'm not so alone anymore. Exactly. You crossed all those centuries to find all of us, so... Why can't a little doll have made the same jump too? Right? Look, it's up to you to decide if there's any meaning behind all of this. But I choose to think there is. Yeah, I think so too. There's something beautiful about the whole thing that simply can't be denied. I'm looking forward to breakfast. Are you tired, Hoodle? You sure he's not just trying to hide from us? <laughs> I think we've helped these people just about as much as we can going to need more long-term aid than we can provide on our own. You're right. We need to ask the other realms to send help, and fast. Another reason to hurry and find a way out of Ganaparos. Agreed. Start looking for a way out tomorrow. For now, we should spend the day resting up while we can. <laughs> 